Uh, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. I'm addressing uh, S6 students. Semantics. Uh, we're going to see some sense relations. Uh, sense relation refers to relations of meaning between words. The first sense relation is homophony. Homophones are words. Homophones, so homophony, homophones are words that sound the same, but they are spelled differently. So these are words that have the same pronunciation, but their writing, the way they are written, is different. Examples are C and C. Uh, the C where you swim and the verb to see, you see with your eyes. Uh, high and high. High, a mountain is, is high. Or the greeting high, like hello. Meat and meat. Meat, the meat that you eat, or meat when you meet somebody. So these words, like see and see, high and high, meat and meat, are examples of homophones because they are written, they are written differently. They are written, they have different spellings, as you can see, but they are pronounced in the same way. Homophones. Now, homographs is another sense relation, and again, sense relations uh, refers, this word, this phrase, refers to the relations of meaning between words. So, homographs are words, let me just move this so that you can see the slide, are words that are spelled in the same way, they are written in the same way, but they are pronounced differently. They have different pronunciations. Uh, homographs are spelled in the same way, but are pronounced different way, uh, differently. Examples examples are the following. Uh, tear and tear. Tear and tear. Uh, the first tear, uh, it's a noun, tear and tear. Tear, when you, when you cry, you shed tears. Uh, tears from your eyes when you're crying and tear means to rip something minute and minute minute and minute so minute 60 minutes make an hour but minute means small wind and wind the, the, the meaning is not important for homography what matters is there are pronounced in the same way, but they are written, I mean they are pronounced in different ways, but they are written in the same way, like record and record. Another example you can add, like advocate and advocate. Advocate as a verb, it's, a, it's spelled A-D-V-O-C-A-T-E, Advocate means you speak or write in support of somebody or in support, in support of a cause. And advocate is a noun, is a person who supports a cause. Again, another example of homographs. I'm sure you can think of dozens and dozens of examples. Thank you. Barakallahu alaikum. Salam alaikum.